So guys, today we're taking a look at the Rope Bridge mod for Minecraft. A mod that adds, you guessed it, rope bridges into Minecraft. And the rope bridges look something like this, which is exactly what you're seeing here. And you can deploy them pretty much almost anywhere. Although there is a steepness requirement as you'll see later on in the video. But one cool thing about this mod is that you might think that, okay, well, it's a rope bridge mod. So what does it really do? It means that you build the bridge manually by yourself. The answer to that is no. The bridge can actually be built automatically for you and that's what makes this mod really, really convenient, especially if you have it in a single player world. Uh, it not only looks nice aesthetically, but you can actually deploy the rope bridge itself automatically without you having to place down the blocks yourself. So before we get into the nitty gritty details, don't forget to drop a like on the video, consider subscribing because I upload Minecraft mod showcases like this here on the channel on a regular basis. And let's get started with the rope bridge mod showcase. So as mentioned earlier, the rope bridges are not manually built. You can actually deploy them automatically and you can do so by using the bridge building gun. Now the crafting recipe will be shown on screen right now for a couple of seconds. So feel free to take your time, pause the video and go through the crafting recipes that are on screen right now. So once you have successfully crafted your bridge building gun, you can mouse over it and it will actually give you some instructions on how to use the gun. So you can see you can hold right click to build the bridge. You can sneak to break the entire bridge all at once, which I'll show, show to you guys later. It's actually pretty fun to watch. Okay. But this bridge building gun, guys, it's awesome. Okay. It allows you to deploy bridges like this within seconds. So enough of the talk. Let's actually try it out. But one important thing to note is that you can't build bridges if there are blocks in the way. Uh, if it's too steep, the bridge won't generate as well, and you can only build bridges in the north, south, east, west direction. Okay, so you can't do it like, like this angle, for example, okay? When I right-click to draw it back, right, just like what you would do with a bow and arrow in Minecraft, it sort of locks you into the direction that your character is already facing. So if I were to try to move towards my right, you can see it doesn't let me, it just forces me to look straight ahead. And if I were to release it, you can see that it says, sorry, your slope is too great. Please try again. So this is the steepness requirement that I mentioned. So it can't be like from a really high point to a really low point or a really low point to a really high point. The steepness must be more gradual like what you see here. So remember, as I mentioned, it needs to be north, south, east, west direction. So let's actually try it with this block here. Okay, so we're going to aim and we're going to release it. And it says there's something in the way, probably these leaf blocks, right? So let's try one from here to here, just a really short distance, right? And you can see that it generates the rope bridge instantaneously and it looks aesthetically amazing. I think it looks like one of those, you know, board walks that you see in the zoo, uh, those treetop walks, <laughs> really cool design. And yeah, you can see it's like a bunch of logs uh, sort of uh, clamped together like so. A really cool like jungle-esque design so if you have a jungle biome in minecraft this road bridge definitely wouldn't look out of place there okay so let's try one from here to here i'm not sure if it will work because again the gradient is pretty steep but let's actually try it out uh no okay it doesn't what happens if we do this so i've reduced the angle it's still too great okay let's try it again i think this time around it should work and there we go guys we have a rope bridge it's as simple as that so you might be thinking to yourself, hey, I think this mod is a bit OP. Can't I just generate road bridges wherever I go in Minecraft? And the answer to that is yes. Well, only if you're in creative mode. Okay, so if you're in creative mode like I was just now, then you can pretty much deploy all your road bridges whenever you want, wherever you want, without costing any resources. But now, as you can see, I've switched to survival mode and the story is a bit different here. So if I were to try my bridge building weapon here, Let's try that again and you can see it says you need at least 6 slabs and 12 rope to build this bridge. So rope is a brand new crafting material that you will need to craft in order to deploy those rope bridges that you saw earlier. So what you need is firstly a crafting table of course and you need some vines and some string. And what you would do is you would place these vines and string in alternating patterns. So I have a vine and I have a piece of string here and now I need a string and a vine and back to a vine and a string. And this pattern here would give you eight pieces of rope. So now comes the fun part. We are actually going to destroy the rope bridge. And guys, it's going to destroy itself in a pretty spectacular fashion, okay? 
So instructions are available here when you mouse over. So what you need to do is you need to sneak and you need to click the bridge in order to break it. So let's actually try that here. So I'm gonna break down this entire bridge, okay? So let's actually try it. You guys will see what I mean. It's gonna look amazing, okay? Are you ready? So I'm sneaking. Three, two, one, break. Oh, okay, well, I, I need to actually shift click. Okay, that, that was a bit of a, <laughs> that was a bit of a letdown. Let's try that again, okay? So we have a bridge here. I'm shifting. Let's actually break it. And there you go, guys. It, <laughs> it's so amazing to watch, okay? You get a warning, but actually the warning comes a bit too late, right? Because you pretty much broke the entire bridge and there's no way of reversing it. Yeah, but you saw the way the rope bridge just split apart like that. It was amazing, okay? Let's try it again for this bridge. Okay, I can just watch this all day, okay? Let's try it again. So shift, and let me just get this angle here. And there you have it, it sort of ripples apart. So believe it or not, that's not all that the mod actually adds. It may be called the rope building mod, but the mod author has added in a ladder gun as well. And this gun is currently not available via survival mode, so you can't actually craft it. But it's available through the creative mode menu, you can just drag it into your inventory. And like its name suggests, it basically deploys ladders anywhere you want to go in Minecraft. So really simple, let's say I want to go up this dirt block, right? All I need to do is right click and release it and it deploys a ladder. And this ladder actually costs resources as well. So if I were to head back into survival mode here, you can see that I have 28 rope and one oak slab. So if I were to build a ladder here, you can see that it takes away one oak slab as well as two rope. So it does cost resources. So that's the mod in a nutshell. It adds in your bridge building gun, your ladder gun. I mean, what more could you really want in Minecraft but spectacular rope bridges that fall apart so dramatically, right? I could watch that over and over again. That's probably my favorite part of this mod is actually destroying the rope bridges. No, but seriously though, the rope bridges look really, really cool. Like I said, if you're in a jungle biome, they just fit right in. And yeah, aside from the aesthetics, they are functional as well. You can just walk on them like you would a regular bridge that you built yourself in Minecraft. And it's just a really handy gadget to have. And it's good to see that the mod author has added a ladder gun as well. Maybe he will expand into other gadgets in the future. And if you're interested in downloading this mod, link to it is in the video description down below. It's really easy to install, available for Minecraft Forge. Thank you guys so much for watching. Check out the other mod showcases that I've done on my channel and the other Minecraft videos. I promise you guys won't be disappointed. Help me get to 7,000 subscribers, guys. We are approaching that milestone really quickly. So hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so. And I will see you guys in the next Minecraft video.